Ladies and gentlemen, my name is Kyle A and I am your coach of the Miami Dom fans and we are the only team that matters. And today, today is playoff time, baby. Playoffs in the APA season three and we are taking on none other than my homie, my brother, my boy Dan, aka A-Drive and his St. Louis Rampardos. Now guys... I'm I'm pretty nervous for this game. I think I'm like two and three or two and four against Dan all time. He definitely has the upper hand. And um I brought a very similar team, um, but we uh we did change up some of the sets here. But um you guys should check out the game that we played earlier in the season. Uh I battled Dan and uh I'm hoping that you know we can we can get into it. Now I'm going to give you five seconds to pause and go watch yesterday's NPA battle. Five, four, three, two, one. Okay. All right, so if you're still here, I'm assuming that you watched that battle. The, okay, and he doesn't even bring Whimsicott anyways. Okay, so I was like, I put Whimsicott on the layout because, man, last night, uh, well, well, today's Sunday, right? So yesterday, I played against... Um, in NPA, I played against Iron Boffin. Oh my god, he doesn't bring anything I thought he was going to bring. Holy shit. Okay, this isn't good. This isn't good at all. Um, at least there's no Celesteela, but... Okay. Um, we see Staraptor. He's already ready. This boy is ready. He's ready to go. Oh, man. Okay, I was not expecting this. Um, and let me just throw Cresselia on the layout real quick. I think I, I think those are the only three, right? The first three. Oh, shit. Cress is huge. Look at how huge Cresselia is. <laughs> okay, um, I have a few options that I can lead with, though. He does bring Mimic U, Sun, and Mega Hound Doom. Um, okay, looking at this, I'm just going to stick with my normal plan, and I'm going to lead off with Coco. I'm going to get that terrain set. I'm going to get that terrain set. I think that it is pretty good that we don't see Celesteela. Um, I'm pretty sure that part of the reason he did that is because of the last time we battled, where Porygon 2 was able to trace the Celesteela and, uh, and get the beast boost. So, why is there, like, no audio right now? Like, why is there no game audio? Okay, here we go. Let me just raise that up real quick. Okay, cool. So, Staraptor lead. Okay, let me see. Um... Okay, I think this should be good for volume. I think this should be good for volume. So let me see. Um... I want to see what like Staraptor could do if he's like scarfed. Because I do see that like possibly being a thing. And he can kill us like straight up with double edge. I'm pretty sure he's choice scarf. I know I don't want to take that, um, so I have a couple options here. I can go Porygon 2. I can do, um, I could go Seismitoad, but I don't really want to go Seismitoad. Maybe I should. Alright, I need to think, I need to think, I need to think, because... Let me double check what my Porygon is. Um, summary... Okay, we are Trace, that's what I had to make sure. Um... Let me try and see this real quick. Try and change this. I'm max it. Okay. You know what? I'm 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 actually am gonna go into my size of the toad. I'm gonna see what we can do here. If he attacks me, he's 100% scarf. Like, okay, he switches too. And he goes into Reptar. Who's that? Okay, he he does go Nidoking. King. Okay, so U-turn. 
U-turn would have been okay there, but um, that's not the worst case scenario. So, Toad ver Toad versus Ditto King. Okay, let me see. <laughs> this is the matchup of a century. Okay, um... Toad vs. Nidal King. Um, the good news is I can kill him with EQ. I can also set up rocks. Um, I kind of, I kind of want to go for EQ, but just in case he does switch, I'm gonna set up rocks. And now he knows I'm Scarf because he stays in. Rip. He goes for Earth Power. He's gonna do a lot. Oh my god, are we dead? Ha! Oh, lived on 26? Oh my god. Okay, I got 14%. That was... Is he modest? Because that does more... Yeah, he's got to be modest. Because that, that should have... I should have killed us. Um, rip. Okay. That's not good for me. That's not good. Okay, at least we got rocks up. At least we got rocks. Um, I think that I can... Okay, hold on. Your boy... Your boy can go in here. Your boy can go in. I think I can go into Porygon 2. Um, let me see something. Okay, so <laughs> I gotta tell you something, guys. I lost the. On my keyboard, <laughs> I lost some of the key, like the keycaps or whatever. So it's like. My instinct is to like, you know, like to type, but like I always have to look down sometimes if I'm a type G or H. Like I don't, I don't know why. I just have to. Um, I'm gonna go into my Porygon because I'm kind of stuck right here. So here's the thing, right? He could be. He's he's either modest or he specs. He has to be one of the two. And he switches. I think he might be specs. And he goes into Cresselia. Okay, okay, um... Alright, Porygon versus Cresselia, let me see here. He's gotta be choice spec since he's... I'm gonna, I'm gonna type this down. Because... Well, hold on. Let, let's see if he is, if he's timid. Choice specs. Yeah, okay. Yeah, that makes sense too. Then modest life orb. I bet he is timid specs. Um, I'm just gonna try attack here. He's probably gonna toxic me. Or he's gonna switch. Thinking that I'm gonna toxic him. Let's see, Cresselia. I mean, try attack doesn't do a whole lot, but it'll at least hit something else if he tries to bring it in. Leo just <laughs> look at Leo. <laughs> Leo on the DMs was good. That boy's trying to play some Fortnite. Okay. Switches into Franklin the Turtle. Okay, he goes into the Turtle Boy. Okay, Turtle Boy. We got Turtle Boy taking some rock damage. Okay, that's clean. The Sun. Oh, the Sun, man. Okay, here we go. Try attack. Let's get it. Oh my god, that's a crit. Mm. Yikes. That's not how I wanted to kill him. Yep, that crit definitely mattered too, because if he's like standard, like non-special defense invested, that should have done 48 to 58, and he was at 75. If he has no HP investment, it still mattered. So, um, regardless, that crit matters. That that kind of that sucks. But, hey,
Um, P2 kills... What that? What's that thing's name? Torkel. I almost... I typed Franklin at first. Alright. Griselia back in. Okay. Let me see what I can do to Griselia with Thunderbolt. Because we, you already know we got the Thunderbolt on my boy Porygon 2, and we're in the terrain. It's still going to do zero. 20 to 24. Not worth it to me. Not worth it to me. All right, we're going in. We're going out. We're going to my boy Clayton. I'm gonna do it for Clayton right here, baby. Okay, look, check this. Okay, he does go for Toxic and hits that. Okay, so Toxic. All right, not the worst. Crest has Toxic lefties. Okay. Okay, Crest has Toxic and lefties. Darn, terrain's gone, but sun is up. Flare Blitz, oh, Cozen. In the sun. Oh my gosh, like, even if he's at full, like, it just, it... <laughs> Darn, man, it's, it's so good. What the heck? Wait, hold on, that's if he's... Yeah, it's still, we're still, we can still kill him. Um, with Flare Blitz. However, I think that the play might actually be to Rock Slide here. Because he may go into Houndoom, which he does. Oh my gosh. Don't miss. Don't miss, baby. I have never missed before. That's going to kill. Oh, that's what I'm talking about, Darm. Oh my gosh. Darm kills Houndoom with Rock Slide. Oh my gosh. That is huge. Holy cow. All right, okay, 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 okay. All right, Kyle, calm down now. You're still, you're still playing against, still playing against the Lord here, so you can't. All right, here comes Star, Star Raptor can definitely kill me there with literally anything. Like, oh yeah, dude. Oh my God, Brave Bird 97 minimum, Double Edge 97 minimum. <laughs> Jesus. I'm going to sack off my Seismitoad here. Um, if he defogs, he's a god. Okay, he just goes for Brave Bird. Okay. I was like, if he defogs, he's a god. Like, <laughs> But I don't think he would do that. Just because Darn was out there. Okay, so. St um, Staraptor kills size with. Brave bird. Okay. So what size my toad? Four? Okay. At least at least we got them Rockies up. We got them Rockies up. Rocky Rockies is on the field. Okay, so and Darm's still in good shape. Does Porygon 2 live a hit? Yes, we do live a hit. Although I think that it'd be better if I go Coco. Get get that get that young terrain up, baby. Get that young terrain up. Um let me see right here. What if I do this? I hate whenever like I type in the Pokemon in the calculator and then I click the wrong set. So it's like, I have to do it again. Um, let's see, there's a little 50. I mean, I kill him with Volt Switch, but last time he went to Nidoking. So I kind of want to see, we know he specs Nidoking. Like U-turn would be good. But I think we can Volt Switch, because last time he went to Nidoking, King, so I don't think he'll do it again. And if he does, shame on me. He does, okay. Alright, okay, not the worst. Not the worst. Alright. 
Now, I got two options here. I can bluff the Scarf and switch out. Or I can you turn because I know I outspeed. The only problem is he has so he has so much HP, man. He only he only took rocks. Okay, like Nidoking King is the thing that like legitimately is just so like dope to me. Like I actually love Nidoking, King, man. Like I, I need that boy on my squad someday. Like I, I gotta draft that thing someday. Um. All right, so right here. What does Halucha do to this? Not, not enough. Not, not enough. <laughs> it, it does not do enough. Um, but I can U-turn anyways into that. Oh, never mind. I am Scarf. Why was I talking about bluffing the Scarf? I was like, I'll bluff the Scarf, bro. You are Scarf. What are you doing? <laughs> Oh my god. Alright, let's go, baby. Let's get that electric seed up. Double speed, double speed, Halucha. He goes for Toxic. Okay, lands it. Alright. Now, the thing is, we know he is choice specs. So I'm pretty sure he has to switch. And if he's not choice specs, then I just messed up. Okay, yeah. Okay, he definitely is. All right, he's switching out. He goes to Moon Duck, and we get a free Swords Dance. Yes. Okay, Cresselia. Jeez, even at plus two though, like we don't do anything, and we die like to Psychic. So it's like, what? oh, you know what? I'm calculating acrobatics with an item. Oh, yep, there we go. It still doesn't kill. It still doesn't kill. Damn it. Alright, we gotta go for it right here. I gotta get greedy. I'm sorry, guys. I gotta go for it. Another SD. Another one! Another one! Alright, we're plus four. If we don't die to the Psychic, we win the game. I think. Oh, I think we're dead. We lived on six, but we take... We're gonna take poison. We couldn't have killed him anyways. Um, that, that sucks. Alright. <sighs> Nidoking King kills Lucha. I didn't really have... I, I, I wasn't gonna kill him anyways, right? I was dead either way there, so I guess taking damage would have been good. I should have... I should have just... Fuck, I should have just attacked him. Okay, no worries. Um... Nidoking King gets that kill because it was toxic damage, so... Halucha, thanks for no thanks for nothing, Halucha. <laughs> and now I can't outspeed fucking... Can't outspeed... Staraptor. And the sunlight went away, so it's not like Darm can... Darm can't Oko in the sun. Think, Kyle. Think. I think I can still. I think I still need to just flare blitz him. I think that's what I need to do. I'm just not even gonna hesitate. I'm, I'm clicking flare blitz. I'm flare blitzing. I'm blitzing. It's blitz. I'm bringing the blitz. Blitz the league, baby. Have you ever played that game, Blitz the League? Leave a comment and let me know if you play Blitz the League or Blitz the League 2. Whenever you do like the, the hit stick and then it has like, it shows like the bones, like. That's a good game, man. Blitz the League 2. That game is my, that is my jam, dude. Like, that's actually my shit. Oh my god, this is a good game. Oh man, if he would have moonlighted there, that could have been clean. Um, but. He does go for the Psychic anyways. Alright, he takes that very well, and I think we're gonna die. Oh, he Moonlights here. Yeah, I think we lose to Cresselia. That sucks, man. I shouldn't have... I shouldn't have did that. I shouldn't have SD'd again. Um, I can't... Yeah, he's like max defense.
He's like, oh man. I, th I thought, am I? I have to be missing something because I thought, like, according to my, according to my, according to my calculations, <laughs> according to the calc though. Even if he's, oh, you know why? Because I was putting that in max attack and not max defense. Ha ha ha! ha. Look at you, Kyle. Fifty-seven to seventy. Damn, that sucks. Yeah, he's max defense, bold. I can't, I'm not, I can't touch him. I just have to flare blitz him and do damage. And he's into moonlight again. Oh, he goes for hidden power, okay. He's gonna kill me uh, with toxic here. All right, he takes lefties. I think I died of toxic. Please live. Oh my God, we lived on 14. We lived on 14, let's go. Okay, so I have an option here. I have an option. Um, actually, no, I don't. I have to just flare blitz him. I was like, I, d I don't have a U turn, so I have to just, I have to just die here. Um, he'll probably go to mimic you and just break his. Probably go to mimic you and break his uh, disguise, but I for I always forget if disguise like goes through rocks, right? Like, I, I think that it doesn't. I don't think rocks breaks the disguise. I think I have to hit him, so I think that he'll. I don't think he lets Cresselia die. I think it's too good for him to have. If he sacked off Staraptor, that would be fucking huge. That would be huge for us if he sacks off Staraptor here. But I don't see it happening. He'll probably go like Needle King or he'll just go Mimic you because we hit the Disguise. Unless I'm wrong and the Disguise does break on rocks. And in that case, that's probably why he's thinking about it. Um because oh man let's see what scissor can do like okay so mega scissor we're not faster though i bet he he had he, like he he has to be ready to outspeed us mega scissor right like and we know he has hidden power he went he went for hidden power like predicting us to switch out so Okay, he switches into what, into what, into what, into what? Yep, Mimic you. All right, that's what I thought. Okay, so we're just gonna die to Toxic. Needle King gets two Toxic kills, bro. What? <laughs> uh, unless Needle King didn't Toxic us and something else did. All right, well, the good news is I take no recoil to that, but I'm gonna take Toxic damage and I'm gonna die, so. Oh, dead. Good news is I can go Scizor and just bullet punch him. Where's Darm? Oh my shit, he's, he's number two, okay. So I, on the layout, I, so I use the same slide, right, for like each of my leagues. So I don't have the, the Pokemon saved on there like Mega Scizor or Porygon 2. Like I don't have that because OBS Studio only lets you have a certain amount of images on here or PNGs or you know, gifts or whatever you're using so i have to like just name them one two three four five six and then like one two three four five six in roman numerals like for my opponent because you can't have two of the same name so it's like every game like i have to switch like the names on them so it's just like really frustrating um at times at times it's frustrating all right i'm gonna go scissor mega evolve and bullet punch I don't, I don't think I need to question that. Could Swords Dance. Well, I already clicked it, though. I mean, I already clicked it, but... I could have Swords Danced, maybe? Expecting him to switch, but then I would be risking the whole game on a prediction, and he stays in anyways. I wonder if he's like the Steel Berry. But I'm Max Attack Adamant. So I, I don't think it would live anyways. Is there? There's a steel berry, right? No, he's just gonna die. Okay, that's fine. All right, cool. Um, Mega Scizor kills Mimic you. Oh my gosh, dude. He okay, and he just went straight into old boy. Straight to Nidoking, King. Okay. Nidoking. 
We know he's faster. Um, so we know he's faster. I need to see what else I can switch here. Maybe if I do this. Specs. Hidden Power Fire is gonna definitely kill me, right? Or I'm pretty sure he gets a I'm pretty sure he gets fire moves. Like he's gonna get like flamethrower or some shit, so. Hidden Power Fire kills me anyway, so any fire move is gonna kill me. Um The only problem is if he predicts me to switch and goes for like Earth Power, my Coco's dead. Oh man. You know what? I think man, I'm just looking at the calcs. It's like I have to I have to I have to win on a play here because he has the upper hand. So the only way I'm making it out of this alive is with a bold play. So this is what we need. I need to hope. I need to hope that he did not click Sludge Wave or Earth Power. I feel like he clicked Earth Power right here. I feel like he's going to click Earth Power. But... He goes for Flamethrower. Oh, man. Okay. I'm pretty sure we live this. Okay, maybe not. Okay, yeah. 46. Okay, cool, 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 cool. So... Um, Coco. Bruno, out! What are you doing in here, bro? Get out. Go. You're not supposed to be in here. Get out. The dogs. Oh my god, you hear that? Okay, um, let's see here. Alright, this is what I can do. Oh man. Oh man, oh man, oh man, oh man, oh man, oh man, oh man. I have to just go for Dazzling Gleam. I don't have a choice. Like, I, I have to. Because if I U-turn, I can't, like, I can't beat him. I, th I think he gets us here. I think he, I think he got us. Um, yeah. GG, Dan. Oh, he goes for Toxic! He expected Porygon too. I get the Dazzling Gleam again now. Okay, cool. I was gonna let him kill me. Oh man, I, 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 okay. That may have put us back in it. That may have put us back in it, honestly. It's gonna depend because it's still a, oh yes. Oh yes. Wait, he's not Specs then. What is he? He's a Z move. He has to be a Z move. He bluffed that so well to me. That's crazy. He oh, uh, you know what? I bet he I bet he is life orb. I always forget that this thing is sheer force. Like, I'm such a fool. I bet everybody is gonna like <laughs> I'm gonna have so many people, so many people just flaming me right now. Like flame on in the chat. They're like, Kyle, you're an idiot. It's sheer it's uh sheer force life orb. But the very first calc with Sheer Force Life Orb, didn't reach the same amount, so he has to be Modest Life Orb. I bet that's what he is. I bet he's Modest Life Orb. He has to be, because that's the only way. And if he's not, then something's wrong on, on my end with, with the calking here. So I have a second, right? Let me get Coco up off the off the, the thing here. So I think what I can do here, I think I have to, I think I have to go into the tech here. I think I have to go into the tech here. Um... Oh, man. Okay, we're going to try Sheer Force. Porygon 2 with the tech. It's time. He switches. Okay. Okay. He goes in a Mohawk. He goes in a Mohawk. But look at the tech. Agility Porygon 2, baby. Okay. Um, agility Porygon 2. All right, here we go. I think he probably still outspeeds us. Does Scarf the Raptor outspeed me? Yeah, it does. Okay.
And that does over half. Oh, man. It does do over half. Rip. Okay. Okay. Okay, P2. Okay, P2. Okay. Kill Staraptor with try attack I'm I'm not sure because I feel like him going for that toxic there may have put us back in the game to win it because okay so crest comes out We know he's like max fizz death He has to be since he was eating those darmanitan hits like that which means I should be able to kill him. I should be able to kill him right here with try attack And guys, I'm telling you, if we do this, I believe we win the game. I'm going for it. I could recover. I could recover, but I'm Kyle A, baby. And we do it for the hype. We do it for the rolls. Oh, there it is. P2, baby. P2 kills Cress with try attack. Oh my gosh. This game was insane. Agility Porygon 2. Here comes Nidoking. King. I'm going to try attack again. We outspeed. Oh my god, dude. Holy cow. GG to Dan. We are going to pick up the 2-0 victory in playoffs, baby. We are going to round two to either play the winner of Crimson Seabad and or uh, Jacob, as always, whoever wins their game. So go watch their game, too, because we played the winner of that. GG to Dan, man. That was an awesome game. I... Oh, man, that, that, that was a good one. That was, like, back and forth because there were times when I was, like, I just lost or I was, like, okay, I think we did it. And then, uh, like, I overpredicted with the Swords Dance and then he predicted me with the Toxic Switch. So it, that, that was that was a clean game, man. That, that was a good one. That That's what you would look for in a playoff game. You guys should go check out the other playoff game we had in WBE because that game, in my opinion, was even better than this one. Um, so you guys should go check that out as well. But that's all I got for you, Don fans. Roll out.